Haunt Town is a guild project for Web3 builders all around the world. The goal of Haunt Town is to provide a complete society for builders such as founders, developers, designers, artists, marketers, or any kind of roles working for Web3 projects. Uh, to accomplish that mission, we're running two base camps for the Web3 builders. Builders will showcase pages like this, like website, and Discord space. Uh, let's check the website first. So via the Haunt the Town website, builders can display their many kinds of activities on the Web3 space, such as their, their awesome Web3 profiles and their uh, project activities, Web3 event participations, project ideations, and, and network activities. So many uh, awesome Web3 activities can be displayed via the Haunt the Town website. Uh, let's check their uh, uh, Web3 builders profile pages. So, first of all, uh, you can check uh, uh, already a lot of Web3 Builders profiles that are generated via the Hunt Town Guild. And I'm going to show you actually my cool uh, profile pages like this. So, this is my Builder profile page uh, generated by Hunt the Town. Uh, Hunt Town will show your Web3 identity as, a, as coolest as possible so that you can share this link with any other uh, people and uh, or or like a, your Twitter or other social pages. Um, also, this page uh, shows all kind of your web free activities as explained earlier, such as your role. So my role is like a marketer, founder, designer, and uh, your uh, project activities and uh, your cool ideas uh, generated, uh, shared via Hunt the Town. Uh, so, so many activities can be uh, shared in a nice way in your website, uh, in build, Builder's profile. Um, so, the beauty of the Hunt Town is that you're actually joining, uh, like, a, not as an individual, uh, not as a project uh, itself, uh, but you're joining uh, by your individual identity. I think that's the beauty of this project. So as you, as you know, the full cycle of Web3 project is quite short, but the builders behind the project still exist, right? Uh, so by gathering them in this one space, you can always be connected with other builders uh, regardless of their project goals or lives. So I think this is the most important. Uh, so as you can see, you can still uh, explore all different kinds of Web3, cool Web3 projects that shared uh, via Hunt Town Guild. But still, these uh, people behind this project, these are more important uh, sources, resources in this Hunt Town Guild, and you can be connected with them. Okay, so uh, let's see how actually it works, the ecosystem of the Hunt Town Guild. Uh, so we have uh, building NFTs. Uh, so, uh, the, uh, in order to become a member of this guild, you actually need to own at least one membership NFT called Hunt Building NFT. The thing is that you won't purchase this NFT from the team. That's the biggest difference with other uh, members' projects. You're minting this NFT by locking up a thousand Hunt fungible tokens for one year. Uh, after the lockup period and uh, after the lockup period is finished, and uh, if you, you don't need this NFT anymore, uh, then you can burn this NFT later. And then the 1,000 hot tokens that were locked in uh, will be returned to you. So in this way, this guild place can be fully decentralized and not controlled by the sole team's roadmap. Uh, like, you know, other NFT membership projects like, uh, you know, completely controlled by the team's roadmap, right? But Hunt Town, uh, uh, the, the, because uh, you're not purchasing uh, physically this NFT from the team, uh, this can be more decentralized guild. Uh, we also have an uh, uh, interesting uh, ecosystem called Build Point System uh, to amplify builders, uh, builders' interactions inside the guild space. Uh, we're using our virtual point system. So this is kind of virtual point system that only be used in the Hunt Town Guild place. Um, so when you verify your building NFT ownership, you, you can get the build points on a daily basis actually. And they can be used uh, for tipping, asking helps, using like Web3, all different types of Web3 tools and uh, buying Web3 vouchers that other builders provide. Uh, 
Already over 25 uh, Web3 products are providing their exclusive deals, targeting the builders of Hunter Town via this Web3 voucher system, so which is really useful for lots of Web3 builders already utilizing this build point system, ecosystem for them. All right, so we do have fun, uh, uh, fungible tokens called Hunt Token, as I mentioned. Uh, so all building NFT, the members pass, contains a thousand Hunt ERC20 tokens inside. And these tokens have quite abundant liquidities uh, because uh, actually we've developed this token uh, over the past five years. It's not like tokens from suddenly uh, nowhere. Uh, Hunt token has been listed uh, many uh, uh, many cent top centralized exchanges such as Upbit, Huobi, or Maxi, and also uh, over $2.3 million uh, amount of uh, liquidity for Uniswap. So by maintaining this abundant liquidity for Hunt tokens, we can make the building NFT to have a sustainable market value. All right, so I think this is quite enough to show our uh, like a showcase page. Uh, now uh, our second base, which is Discord channel, that you need to uh, discover. So, as I say, this uh, Discord is uh, also our uh, important places for web three builders activities, right? So, uh, when you join this uh, Discord. Uh, you will be uh, requested to create your awesome build a profile like that. So like, you know, your nickname uh, and then Twitter account and then your uh, short and long explanations. And then when you submit this, then, then you will get the, uh, you will get some access of the public zones like that. Uh, let's see those public zones, what you can do. Uh, as you can see, so there are already over uh, 523 uh, Web3 builders have joined this guild. Um, when you, uh, so in the profile channel here, you can see, uh, let's see, yeah. In the profile channels, you can explore all builders uh, joined this guild and uh, ask a coffee chat actually to have one-on-one -on -one conversa conversations. Um, let me check uh, my profile here. So project seven. See, this is my profile. And then uh, if you like me to talk with it, then you can even request coffee chat here. Then you can, uh, and if I uh, approve that coffee chat, then, then we're gonna have one one uh, channels directly here so that we can have some uh, private conversation uh, together. Okay, and um, let's see. Uh, this is uh, this is like a lounge channel, like you know. Uh, so can I? You can chat uh, chat out with other builders uh, freely, uh, and then also you can uh, you can actually save some useful tweet messages, tweet contents by taking like a simply save to Discord. I'm gonna show you this is quite a cool feature. So, you know, when you disco, uh, explore uh, Twitter, uh, you want to share with your build guild member, right? But uh, it's kind of time consuming to copy and paste in the channel, right? So what you can do is that uh, you, if you think this is quite uh, uh, beneficial, you can see like this, save to Discord. Uh, you can just tag it then uh, our Discord will read this content and then share the content here so the other builders can see uh, uh, see this content directly together. All right, and you can share lots of web news and new products. Uh, you can get some build points here. You can share uh, some pro tips, ask many questions, and you can also get uh, uh, very useful answers on uh, Web3. You can share Web3 events. And the beauty of the Web3 events here is that it's not just sharing uh, the, 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 the physical events. It's more like uh, you can get some vibes uh, from the builders who actually participate in the project, uh, in, the, in the events, so that uh, you can feel uh, like you know what's happening there, and then the, what kind of feeling there, and even we show this as a uh, awesome event page like uh, like like this. So when you go to our uh, website, and then there's an event page, and then you can click the ETH Tokyo, for example, and then uh, our website dis uh, displays all different kind of the tweeters that generated for this uh, relative hashtag, so that you can even feel this uh, active vibe, even though you've been not, you've not been there. 
just this kind of awesome features, right? Okay. Mm. All right, and then as I say, we have a build, uh, building NFT, right? And then if you access, uh, if you verify your building ownership, then you can access all the channels here, like this. So see, uh, earlier there is only like a airport and street, which is public zone. And now you, you have access to a private club and tool box. You can access all channels by, uh, uh, by verifying your building, state, uh, building ownership here. Okay, so let's see all some, uh, let's see these uh, private clubs too. Okay, so again, once you verify your building, you can open up all channels in the private club and build us two sections. Uh, in the private zone, there is a separate chat channel, which is the build house. Uh, and then precious idea sharing, like called Idea Labs. Like, actually, there are lots of high quality ideas that are shared in this channel. So uh, many builders can uh, make this as a starting point of the new project, which is quite cool. Uh, also, you can team up uh, easily here because there are all web day builders, so it's really easy to find uh, your right people to, uh, to, to join or to ask them to join to your team. Okay, and then in the toolbox, we actually have a lot of in, uh, interesting tools uh, to that provides for uh, Web3 builders. For example, as I mentioned, there's a Web3 voucher program, right? Um, so, so like uh, there are already added so many uh, exclusive deals targeting for the Web3 uh, uh, builders here. And then what you can do uh, is that you can actually purchase these vouchers by using your build point. Uh, when you purchased it, and then uh, these provider actually provides uh, lots of benefits uh, for you. Uh, for example, like uh, actually there's even s uh, some uh, audit vouchers, like authentic vouchers, and you can get a uh, very exclusive deal from it. Uh, market making, uh, even some uh, PR uh, packages that has lots of discount for targeting Web3 builders. All right, uh, contact book is quite an uh, interesting feature too. So you can look for some uh, in, uh, uh, like email uh, contact points by just look up uh, here like this. So uh, let's say I wanna I wanna uh, I wanna research uh, the con exact context from the crypto.com so that I can uh, get connected with them, right? Then. Oh, probably this is a <laughs> wrong. Uh, uh, wrong domain that I typed. So it's like crypto.com, right? Yeah, it was typo error. Okay, crypto.com. Then, yeah, these lookup boards, they are like this. They uh, disco uh, they kind of parsing all uh, necessary uh, email contacts by using their uh, website and LinkedIn, uh, uh, LinkedIn contact points, and then they display uh, uh, their email contacts like this uh, so that you can uh, look over how huh, these kind of people I can con try to contact, you know, it's really useful to uh, for especially the business developers <coughs> uh, for their web three project. We also have AI tools like chat AI or RTI. You can use ChatGPT for directly here and even you can see other people's using so which is quite interesting to see too, right? And also mid journey. Uh, <laughs> People are already using me journeys here too, and then you can see there are kind of like a, you know well written prompts here, so that you can also learn how to use this uh, me journey uh, uh, better uh, by uh, kind of benchmarking those like a well designed prompt that other people are using. Okay, so I think uh, there are so far more things that I want to share with you, but uh, I think there's a limited time, so I'm gonna wrap up. So what do you think? Uh, you may think that this might be just a typical community project, but it's not a plain community. In general, you need to focus on communities uh, like a designated asset or project, a product. Like for example, if, if, if you're a BAYC holder and so you join the BAYC community, then this whole discourse place is only for the BOIC asset, right? So you won't be allowed to push your project in that space. However, you're joining Hunt Town for your project and your activities, not for the Hunt Town asset. This is the biggest difference. So this can be your Web3 base camp to make your product successful with helping from other builders. Uh, imagine you can gather up like up to 100,000 builders, while the web industry gets bigger than now. 
then Hunt Town's valuation will be priceless and set to be a global base camp, base camp for all Web3 builders, just like a product hunt for Web3, uh, for Web2 product builders, right? Like, you know, product hunt has built up their community spaces over past uh, 10 years. And then now whenever Web2 project uh, founders want to launch something that they kind of look for product hunt first, right? I think Hunt the Town, Hunt Town Guild can become that uh, Web3 project founders, project builders uh, base camp when they launch something or do something because we're going to building up from now on until you know we get up to 100,000 100, builders. That's our goal.